Full-time entrepreneurs, how much more revenue would you have if you executed everything you told yourself you'd do this past year? And how would this change in your revenue affect the quality of life for you and your loved ones? And how much more time could you have spent with them if you instantly executed all those tasks without waiting even weeks or months just to start? But the worst part about this story is that when you don't keep your promises and your commitments to yourself and consistently do the things you know you need to do, your confidence and your self-worth, they get pummeled into the floor. You start beating yourself up mentally and are full of this anxiety, stress, and overwhelm. You start questioning if you do have what it takes to run a successful business. And the worst part is, you might even blame yourself. You might think, what's wrong with me? Why can't I do the things I know I need to do? Well, the reality is, nothing is wrong with you. You've simply been fed an old outdated strategy that doesn't work. You see, all the mindset gurus will tell you, you need more willpower or motivation. But the simple truth is, no amount of willpower or motivation can overcome how your brain is hardwired. You see, you have two parts of your brain. You have the conscious and then subconscious. Now, most entrepreneurs, and this probably includes you, they use their conscious mind. They say things like, tomorrow I'm gonna get up and build this business or I'm gonna hammer out my to-do list. But then one of two things happens. The next day rolls around and they feel this resistance or nagging internal battles. So they say, you know what? I'll do it tomorrow or next week, only for this vicious cycle to repeat. Or the second option that happens is, you know, they start crushing it for a few days and feeling fantastic about themselves until one day they feel tired, lazy, or unmotivated. So they say, oh, I've been doing a fantastic job. I deserve one day off, only for that one day to turn into another and another. And it's so frustrating because they know exactly what they need to do. But again, the reason why they fail to consistently do it is because your subconscious mind dictates 95% of all the decisions you make in your entire day. So essentially you have both parts of your brain battling against each other until ultimately your subconscious mind wins that battle and you revert back into your old patterns and ruts again. Now I know you might be thinking, oh, does my subconscious mind really dictate that much of my actions? So think of it this way. You've likely had a time where you've been driving and you zoned out only to magically appear at your destination with no conscious recall of how you got there. Your subconscious mind took over. I'm also willing to bet when you woke up this morning, you didn't think about which hand you're gonna use to lift the sheets off your body or which foot you were gonna land on first or where you're going to step next. It happened automatically or subconsciously. So you might be wondering, well, what's the correct way to change my actions so that I can grow my business and transform my life? And it's by linking your two minds together. And make no mistake about it, this is literally the only way you can escape this vicious cycle of self-sabotage and procrastination. And the scary part about this story is, the longer you wait, the harder it will be. Because how your subconscious mind operates is all through habits. So every single day, you're cementing yourself further and further into these self-sabotaging patterns that aren't serving you towards the life you want. And unfortunately, what tends to happen is these entrepreneurs keep saying, oh, I'll, I'll get help later or in another month, but then years of their life pass them by and their business is in the same exact place, but now all their problems have gotten worse. How they feel about themselves has gotten so much worse and they're demoralized, all because they failed to take action and find a solution sooner. And so instead of having this glorious life where they have this freedom of time and money and mind, so that their family can travel the world and they can take their wife and girlfriends out to nice dinners, well, guess what? They don't have the funds to do that and they're showing their children firsthand not to go after their ambitions because they're so busy wrapped up in their own business that their children don't even see them and when they do see them, guess what? These entrepreneurs, these fathers, they aren't fully present because their mind's always thinking about what they should have done or what they need to do because they don't have confidence and certainty in their business. They're not doing what they need to do to grow it. But look, this doesn't have to be your story because if you harness our mind linking method, when you tell yourself tomorrow, I'm gonna get up and build this business, you actually do it and you feel excited to do it as well. Those nagging internal battles and that resistance that used to pull you down, 
It's literally gonna be lifting you up in the other direction so that you consistently feel excited to grow your business to the point where working for three hours, it'll feel like one. And you'll be able to accomplish more in one day than you used to in an entire week. You'll have this clarity, this focus, and most importantly, the confidence in yourself. Now look, I've helped countless entrepreneurs like you harness this mind linking method so that they become a superhuman CEO and consistently generate 30,000 or more per month. Now, if you wanna be our next success story, well, you guys know the routine. Click the link around this video and I'll see you very soon.